Hi, my name is Robert Rose. I'm the curator here at Miami Seaquarium, right here in Miami, Florida. There's a couple of small dolphins. There's a Chilean dolphin down in, uh, in South America that's only about four feet long. Um, so there's a couple different species of, of small dolphins. When you look at the Atlantic bottlenose dolphins, these animals will range from about nine feet to, say, 500 pounds. Um, is maybe an average size for these. And so there's animals that are smaller and there's animals that are, that are larger. Some of the freshwater species of dolphins are, are very small as well. And as I said, when I say small, I'm talking about probably about a four foot animal, maybe in about a 200 pound range. So roughly about half of uh, the size of one of the Atlantic bottlenose dolphins that you, that you see here at Flipper. But have many of the same characteristics. They uh, eat the same things. They do the same things that other dolphins do. They're just, just a little bit smaller you know, than the other guys. Well, the Atlantic bottlenose dolphin, the, the, the guys that we have here at Miami Aquarium, they're, they're born and they're typically about two and a half to three feet long and roughly in about a 65 to 75 pound range. And um, for the first typical six, six months to a year, uh, they'll be nursing and even, even longer than that as far as the nursing goes. And around that six month phase, they'll actually start eating, eating fish from us. And, They'll typically grow and add about maybe oh, 100 pounds or so every year. You usually take them about eight to nine years to actually become sexually mature and then about 12 to 15 to be physically mature.